We are officially in Arches National Park. This is part three of our 11 day road trip out west. Join us for a day of hiking in Arches National Park and finally securing a campsite in the Castle Monument Valley in the beautiful state of Utah. Officially in Arches National Park. We're currently making our way to the Delicate Arch Trailhead. It's about 6:48 a.m. and we actually reserved a timed entry ticket for seven, but we got here so early that we just drove right in and didn't have to have to use it. <laughs> I know. Making our way. Sun's just now starting to peak over the ridge. I think we're at like five to six thousand foot elevation out here. So I can get a little huffy and puffy. If you're not careful. Take your time. Once you get in here, you got the whole day. Nadine Gordimer once said, a desert is a place without expectation. Oh, you leave.
うわtrail here there'd only be one trail these glasses are really bad but I have to wear them there and there Trails this way. Thank you. 
Yeah. I'm gonna get this stuff on the way Cool beans. Go ahead. I'm just going to stay up here. Sorry. Good morning, folks. There's people, so. Here you go. the bend see the arch I thought it was going to be like Oh, is it a Oh, that's definitely a Is that not funny? It's so Yeah. 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 
We made it to Delicate Arch. And it's definitely an Instagram versus reality moment. But it was totally worth it. That was probably the tightest thing I've ever seen. the sneaker spot dude like from here no you went up to the arch and then shimmied down and then ran enjoy man <laughs> it's my middle name This is Skyline Arch.
I tried something a little different. I strapped my GoPro to Hannah's back and it didn't have great results. Hair. Hey, this one's so cool. Turn around. And I was hoping we'd be able to. We stopped at Skyway Arch and there was a, pe a trail that sort of followed the canyon and we were just checking it out for a minute. So, it's just crazy how large scaled everything is here. Look at that. Look at that boulder. Like this boulder. <clears throat> that must Excuse have me. fell off. It's crazy. So this is the Sky Arch. Very impressive. Like my mind's blown every time we stop in arches. It's crazy. Took them four hours. Hmm? Did you not overhear them? They said four hours. Yeah. I don't want to do that. Either. Totally not. Oh, yeah. Jamie Lynn once said, jobs fill your pockets, but adventures fill your soul.
It's just so thin. I love it. Huh? It's easy to fall into a place of disparity when you experience something new and you realize it's fleeting. And the only way to counteract this is to make the most out of every moment.
ta pierwsza. Hello, Stamp. We just checked Arches National Park off the list and got our stamp. Now we're moving on. Hey, it's actually not that bad, but this is the line to get into the park. And we didn't have to wait at all. Mind you, it's 84 degrees. It's very hot. It's very hot. It's 84 degrees, and when you're sitting in your car, it gets very annoying. These are all people waiting to get into the park. And there's several like trailheads in there where you have to circle the parking lot like four or five times just to get a parking spot. So we showed up here exactly at like 6:30. Right. So. so panini. Hey. Mm. The food truck park one last day. Well, we got our uh, camp set up for the night. This is the Castle Valley. So we're right on the edge of the Colorado River. And that river's deep and it's moving fast. I dipped my feet in and it dropped off immediately. And I'm, I'm not getting in. I was gonna swim. We seen people swimming earlier, but uh, I'm not getting in that fucking water. The current's moving too quick and there's big chunks of shit floating in the water, so. So right before the Castle Valley here in Moab, I think it's 128. It's a left turn, but this is a place to fill up water. You're gonna need a lot of water. If you come here and camp, and this water is really good and it's ice cold, about to get seven gallons plus the smart water. The moon has just came up above this crimson bluff with my car in the background, our picnic table tent, Colorado River. This is straight magic. I have never seen anything like this in my life. They're like shooting lasers or some shit. There's a guy up, there's, there's a guy in that thing. 
the fuck is that? Oh, it's a traffic thing. If you enjoyed this video, please stick around for part four. And as always, thanks for watching. Some of the old rod action. Mm -hmm. And baked potatoes. That will be nice. Still on the farm.